the roller coaster ride that is a visit to Brooklyn, New York, home to the New York Cosmos. North Carolina FC held a 2-1 lead for a good majority of the game, but the Cosmos with a late equalizer, each team walking away with one point just outside of Coney Island as we welcome you into the WRAL2 studios. Hello, buddy, Dean Linky alongside Jason Gary and we were so close to saying, how about North Carolina FC all the way home? I know they played a great first half. They go up 2-1. Some fantastic goals from some big-time players for North Carolina FC. They kind of let it get away in the second half. Credit to the Cosmos. Put some pressure on them and got their equalizer. All right, Jason, let's go to work and show you the highlights. It was indeed the Cosmos with the first goal of the game. Yeah, the guy we've been talking about all day, IOC, plays the ball in from the left-hand side. Herrera makes a mess of the first one, but is able to finish the second one. Put them up. 1-0 in the first 10 minutes of this game. But how about the response, though, from the team in white? Yeah, it was fantastic. This is an unbelievable goal from Billy Schuler. Watch this strike. Great technique. Puts it in the upper 90. What a fantastic finish from him. Much deserved. Getting the start tonight and definitely earn some more next week. Yeah, Lance Lang with the corner kick. It's punched out by Maurer, and then it'll fall to Schuler. This could be goal of the year. Yeah, it's certainly goal of the week in the NASL. So we get to Lance Lang's goal as well. <laughs> However, Billy Schuler, Bo, just fantastic technique. Maurer just really stands no chance. Look at this thing. I think we get a view from behind the goal as well. And watch this thing bend and swerve and move all over the place. Great finish for Billy Schuler. Incredible for Schuler, part of the NASL team of the month. And now Schuler getting involved again. Yeah, he was playing provider here. They end up calling this goal offside. James Marsland, we saw one replay. It looked like it was a good goal. So North Carolina see kind of robbed of a goal there. Then on the other side, the Cosmos, same thing. Starkov here, great little move to put himself in position. Takes a strike at goal. Sylvester saves it. Herrera taps it in. They end up calling Herrera offside, and we know he wasn't offside. So both teams there got a, a goal called back from offsides. So with the game remaining tied at one, here comes North Carolina FC. Yeah, they were great attacking the first half. Here's an opportunity for Lance Lang. Big time save by Maurer. But look at this run from deep. We talked about them getting in behind and getting balls in behind this Cosmos defense, and Lance Lang certainly did it there. All right, he's denied there, but he will not be denied here. Yeah, this is just a fantastic free kick. Power, pace, curve. He puts that thing right in the bottom corner of the net. Look at this thing. Up over the wall, no chance for Maurer, who I think was cheating a little bit to the far post. Fantastic goal from Lance Lang. If you're keeping track at home, that's two goals that sends the Nets for North Carolina FC. Absolutely, and they kept putting on some pressure. This is the second half, just opening the second half. Billy Schuler gets an opportunity. The ball gets kind of caught up in his feet. We didn't see a lot of attacking after this play for North Carolina FC in the second half. The Cosmos there back in action. They, play, they created five to ten chances here in the second half. Here's one, Christian Ibiaga, big time save off the line. Look at this chance. Six yards from goal, Ibiaga's able to get something on it and keep it out. And that was part of this thing. Marquez, Flores, all of these players for the Cosmos, they finally find Al Hassan with this delicate, beautiful chip to tie this ball game up. The Cosmos weren't done. They would continue to put pressure on Brian Silvestri, who would make that save. And your final score once again, the New York Cosmos 2 and North Carolina FC 2. Don't forget, North Carolina FC back at Wake Med Soccer Park on Wednesday to take on Major League Soccer's Houston Dynamo at 7.30 in the fourth round of the Lamar Hunt U.S. Open Cup. For our crew, Kyle Lang, Savannah Ravel, Rob Rowe, Jason Gary, I'm Dean Linky. your final score from Brooklyn, the New York Cosmos 2 and North Carolina FC 2.